Hello everyone and welcome to this video tutorial where I'm going to walk you through how to use TubeBuddy's new thumbnail analyzer tool. We all know as YouTube creators, uh, a good eye-catching thumbnail is key. And previously through TubeBuddy, we've had the ability to A-B test certain thumbnails and use our own judgment as to which ones we think we should, you know, select and use for our videos. Now, with TubeBuddy's AI, we are able to upload multiple variations of thumbnails for our videos, as you can see right here on this specific video, and we can see which one the AI believes to perform better in CTR, or click-through rate, and that's the name of the game. Uh, people are not going to consume your content if they don't click on your video first. That's fairly obvious. So this tool allows us to pick the thumbnail in which the AI uh, thinks will have the best performance when it's shown to potential viewers. So let me walk you through how to use this tool. So if we navigate over to our YouTube studio and then go to content over here on the side, it'll show a list of our currently uploaded videos. I'm going to choose one of my more popular videos recently, which is my ultimate guide to publishing podcasts on YouTube. And uh, once I'm here, if I have TubeBuddy installed, if you don't, it's absolutely free for 30 days. If you use our link, you can try it out uh, for free for 30 days. Uh, it'll take you right to where you can download the browser extension and you can be up and running in less than five minutes. So once you're here and you have TubeBuddy installed, you're going to see this little thing over on the side once you are at your video settings here. Uh, just click on the little TubeBuddy icon here, or you can click on the TubeBuddy drop-down menu here under the TubeBuddy tools, and under miscellaneous, you'll see something that says Thumbnail Analyzer. Uh, yours may say beta, it may not, depending on when you're watching this video. Now, under the Thumbnail Analyzer, you will have the ability to upload or just drag and drop multiple variations of a thumbnail for a specific video. So as you can see here, I've uploaded four different thumbnails. This one right here is the one that I'm currently using. Uh, these two down here are deemed to be less effective, but this one here at the top is said to be 11% better. Now again, with anything, this is AI, artificial intelligence. There is no guarantee. This is not a perfect science but it is a tool that I believe can help you take your thumbnail game to the next level. So go ahead and upload three, four, five thumbnails and see which ones it says will perform the best. Whether it's a video you've already uploaded and have a current thumbnail, you can see it'll show whether it's an improvement or not, or if it's a brand new video that you're uploading right now, you upload the variations before you make it public and it'll tell you which one will have the best CTR. Again, it's not a guarantee, but which one the AI believes to have the best CTR. So what I would do in this case is I would select this one here, the one that has the 11% improvement, the one that says green recommended right here. And what I would do is I would go to run AB test on thumbnails. Now, if this number was like 40, 50, 60% better, I would probably just go ahead and say use selected thumbnail and it would change from my current thumbnail to the new one. Because it's so close, you know, 10, 11%, I'm going to go to run A-B test on thumbnails. And this is a great tool built within TubeBuddy that allows you to basically run a test for as long as you want, up to 14 days, whatever the date is, which allows you to see at the end of this test which thumbnail performed better. At the end of this, you will know exactly from the data provided by YouTube and TubeBuddy which thumbnail performed the best. So what I would do is I would go to until it reaches statistical significance, because at the end of the day, if you just do 14 days and the video only has like 50 views, you're really not getting anything from that. But if you are a small channel, maybe 14 days is best for you. And then you would want to start it right now. Start as soon as possible and go to next here. And then you can see the alternate thumbnail that we're using. And then just click the blue button that says start test. Just like that, it says your test has been successfully scheduled and you're good to go. That's the thumbnail analyzer. It's a game changer. AI, as we know, is going fast and furious. You're going to see more things like this come down the pipeline. This is just the first of many things that I believe TubeBuddy will be releasing around AI that's going to be able to help you as a YouTube creator. Let me know what your favorite TubeBuddy feature is down below in the comment section. And I really appreciate you guys watching this video tutorial. And I will see you guys in the next video.